Hello everyone, this is PAUH4578, and today we are playing the, um, uh, Endor DLC for Force Unleashed. Now, um, yeah, we'll play on medium. Um, today we are going to be killing, um, loads of teddy bears. Or more commonly known as Ewoks. Now. Yeah, we're going to skip this at our first opportunity. Um, I've played through this DLC before, so I've got most of the force powers upgraded. As soon as I can skip this. Essentially what happens is um, uh, things go pretty bad. Um, essentially, if you play the first Force Unleashed DLC, it essentially carries on the same way. However, it's... Most likely, um, uh, there were slight alterations because you're following um, Lord Vader's instructions instead of Darth Sidious's instructions, and most likely Luke Skywalker at the end of the Hoth DLC was killed instead of turned into an apprentice. It's about a 99% chance that he was killed instead. Come on. I'm trying to skip past the cutscene because um uh, occasionally there can be problems with um uh, more recent games about um uh, cutscenes. One second, options, audio, no subtitles. Perfect. This game hates mute, um, blah, not mute people, deaf people. JK, JK. I'm sure they just didn't have enough time to um uh, put it in, or they um uh, had some other difficulties, or maybe I'm just looking in the wrong spot and I'm looking like a complete targ right now. Now, we've got some of the downloaded costumes. I'm going to see if I can find them if they're not available in the DLC. It's a trap. We're going to use Darth Malak because Kotar was the bomb. Yeah, I'm just gonna switch lightsaber. Get, gonna give him at least one red. I'm sorry, I'm having, um, uh, trouble. It says I've got three bars on the batteries. Not sure why I disconnected. One second. I'm really sorry, I can't really make up my mind, but this will be our final adjustment. The Sith Stalker armor, which is essentially, um, uh, the same armor as in the last game's DLC. 
so that way it can seem like a kind of continuation, I guess you could say. But still, Kodar is awesome. In my opinion, they should make a Kodor 3 because it was, um, honestly, in my opinion, there were there was not many other um, uh, RPGs like that after um, uh, Kodar. Bow before my power. Now. WTF. I'm sorry, this is really unprofessional. It seems whenever I'm hit by a sniper that I disconnect, so I just gotta be not hit by a sniper and things will be perfect. Nope, nope. No sniper bullets. Nope. Snipers cause bad things to. Yeah, the snipers are causing it. That's weird. Nope, nope. Okay. First order of business. We take out that sniper, immediately rush past everyone. If you want my opinions on the, um, uh, protagonists in the Coder games. I prefer Doth Revan. Oh my bad. Um spoilers. Big spoiler. In fact, one of the biggest spoilers of Coder 1. Anyway, I prefer um uh Kodar 1's um uh, protagonist as opposed to um uh, the Exile. And for that matter, I preferred um, uh, Kodar 1 over Kodar 2. trying oh, come on Serious, I can't get up there. Oh, that's right. Basic puzzle solving. I'm a noob. I haven't played this DLC in how long? I've already forgotten. How is it that I was able to make my way through Portal, but not this section? Destroyed speeder. Invasion of the tribal teddy bears. Da na 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 It's Batman. Ugh, the teddy bear actually kind of looked like, I suppose, how Batman glides, and um, uh, I believe. The um, uh, gameplay footage for um, uh, 
that new Batman game that's coming out. I don't care much for the Batman games, but I do care for the Batman movies. They are they are just phenomenal. Teddy bears into space. 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 Tree. Fun fact, um, uh, do that to a normal stormtrooper. What? It's because of you. Anyway, do that to a normal stormtrooper and you'll get a secret achievement. Poor Bob. Space. Ah, uh, missed him. One second. 